So this is it then, the all new version of the world's best sports car. What's it like? Well, what do you think? into the how and why the new GT3 is as brilliant as it is and being no doubt it is sensational here's some technical stuff just have a little chew on first the latest 991 GT3 represents a fairly radical departure from the old car technically although in spirit it is says Porsche very much cut from the same cloth at the back, there's a brand new 3.8 litre flat six that has direct injection for the first time and which produces a faintly astonishing 469 BHP at 8,250 revs. Like the regular 991, it uses electric power steering, tuned in this case to deliver much more feel and bite on the move. And perhaps most controversially of all, it features four wheel steering and is available, shock horror, only with Porsche's seven-speed PDK paddle shift gearbox, which means, yes, there is no longer even the option of manual transmission in a GT3. I know some people will be up in arms about that, but the first time they drive this thing and experience how good and how fast and how awesome the gear changes are, I really don't think they're gonna to wanna to change gear manually ever again. I mean, just listen to this, listen to how fast this thing changes gear. That is incredible, you cannot do that manually. It's amazing. And despite the fact that the new GT3 also weighs a touch more than before, it feels even sharper and even more agile. And yet it rides more comfortably than ever. This is very much a quick go in the GT3. We've only actually got a couple of hours with it. But, I don't know, 10 minutes with this thing and your hair starts to fall out. It's so fast and yet it's really, really stable. It's not as scary to drive anything like as the old GT3, but it is, if anything, even more exciting. And yet the ride, partly because of this little button here, which you can dial up and dial down the stiffness of the dampers, the ride is really, miles better than it used to be as well. It's just got this level of comfort to it, if and when you want it to be comfortable, that really does broaden its repertoire compared with the old model. You could easily live with this car every day. The ride is that much better. The refinement is that much better. And yet, press a couple of buttons, grow a couple of horns at the top of your head, and you've still got one of, if not the maddest cars money for <laughs> The brakes are quite good too. £100,000 is what the new GT3 costs. I'd say that makes it the bargain of the century. This is the best car the Porsche has ever made. And I don't care that it hasn't got a manual gearbox because it is fan mungus tastic The old GT3 was something else, but man, this thing is unbelievable. I tell you, the hairs on the back of my neck are standing upright at the moment. I don't know, I'm speechless. I think this is the best sports car I've ever driven. <laughs> <laughs>